I'm Beth with 50 Plus Beauty, and I'm actually thrilled that you're here with me today because I'm going to be testing a brand new appliance that's supposed to give me bigger lips. It's called Juva Lips, and here it is in its little box, and I have never tried it before. I will tell you that I ordered this product from the Grapevine website, which is a website that puts sponsors together with products. However, I don't want to have sponsored videos, and so the company takes like $4.50. So when I put my bid in to, quote, be a sponsor of this product, I put $5 in as my bid on it because basically I just want to pay that little fee and get the product for free. I'm okay with getting free products because then I can totally give you my honest opinion. And they didn't just send this to me out of the blue. I ordered it from them because I am so excited about this. Now, obviously I have lipstick on, so I'm going to take the lipstick off. Ladies, I'm nervous and excited. According to the info on this device, it says it takes one to two minutes to plump your lips and it's a battery operated device. It says the results last for six to eight hours, which I will be checking in and showing you the results at different points in the day, at least once later today. And it does say, of course, that it's a completely natural product and safe to use with no acids or chemical injections, which is something my husband really cares about. He is very against the idea of me getting lip fillers. So this kind of thing, if it works, would be great for me. Okay, let's go ahead and open it up. And I have opened it already this morning because I did put the batteries in it. It just takes two little AA batteries and they are included, which is wonderful. And it also has this little carrying case. So I happen to be going to Las Vegas tonight with my husband and one of my sons. And this little baby is coming with me if it works. Okay, it comes with a little device and this is a removable mouthpiece, which is cleanable. And then it's got a little filter in here and it comes with several replacement filters in there. I don't really know the purpose of this but you just stick that filter down in there. And for those of you who aren't familiar with my channel, I'm 59 years old and quite lip challenged. If you've seen some of my other videos, I am constantly trying to find ways to pump these babies up. The information on the packaging says to only use it one to two times the first time, and apparently it shuts off after a minute. And I will put a link below to my other two lip videos, and one of which gave me horrendous bruising. That was the candy lips. I would never in a million years touch that thing again. It was a horrendous experience, and that video will be funny for you, but it wasn't funny for me. It says to lick your lips or use lip balm, which I don't have any lip balm in this room, so I'll just lick my lips. Here we go. Mm. Mm -hmm. Well, that looks better. It has a little bit of a lip injection look, which I kind of like that look. No bruising that I can see, although I just kind of like to do this. And I will say it does not hurt, but it's hard to get a little bit of a seal at first. And I remember this from another YouTuber. What you do is you stick your tongue kind of between your two lips, which makes the device seem to grab your lips a little more. I'm going to go ahead and do the second minute. <laughs> Whoa, that is pretty. Man, I think that looks pretty awesome. Oh man, it told me not to do it a third time, but I want to do it a third time so bad. I do. Oh man, I like that. Oh man, that is that is beautiful. Why won't my husband let me get fillers? This is so pretty. I look like I have lips. Oh, ladies, I would love to have lips. You guys keep telling me God didn't make me with lips and I should appreciate them. My little thin nothing lips. But man, that is such a better look. Oh my. Oh my, it's so good. Hey, Allie. Allie, come here for, for a second. I want to show you my lips and I want to see what you think. Let's see what he thinks. Man, I love these. Oh, I'm so happy. Okay, here he comes. Let's see what he thinks. Honey, come in. Even without lipstick, they look awesome. I look like a 60-year-old blonde Angelina Jolie. I'm pretty full of myself because I've got lips. <laughs> okay, come in. You don't have to be on camera, but I want your reaction. What do you think? Oh, he doesn't like them. Why don't you like them? They're beautiful. You don't like them? Come give me a little kiss. Oh, <laughs> come here. See what he's doing. Come here. <laughs> he won't do it. He went, he went like this. <laughs> you guys, he didn't know what's styling because you guys, let's take a vote. Don't you think this looks better? I think this looks better no matter what Heppy says. 
Oh my, I love them. I just love them. Oh my, you guys, this could be the answer. And you know, since this isn't fillers, he can't say anything about this because this is temporary. Okay, I'm gonna lipstick these babies up. And I'm also going to use this little carrying case to take it with me because I'm sure probably today at work, I'll wanna do this again, maybe at lunch or something like that. I'll use this little Marc Jacobs lipstick, which I just got from Sephora. And I really like it. Oh my, they even feel like I've had fillers. Now I'll go ahead and add a little bit of lip pencil just to buff them up even more. You know, the thing I like about this, I was worried they might be too full looking, but they're not. They just are kind of natural looking to me. Unlike fillers, which I do think kind of make your lips look a little strange, they can look a little distorted. I have a girlfriend who gets them and every time she gets them, I don't know, her lips kind of have a funny look. These to me look very natural. I'll put a little bit of the lip gloss that came with the Marc Jacobs kit on there. Just a little bit in the middle. Man, I love this. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, my pictures didn't turn out very well yesterday. I shot them in my car and the lighting was terrible because it was overcast. So we've actually come to Vegas and I've taken the Juva lips with me. And about two hours ago, it's now about one and about 11 o'clock I did my lips and I, I overlined them a little bit so they look kind of silly um, on the top there. That's not the Jewel Lips fault. That is bad application on my um, liner. But anyway, I am loving this. Alan is still not loving this, but I like it. To me, this is a wonderful solution to my small lips and I just am really enjoying it. And I will say, I don't think it lasts six to eight hours, at least for me. I would say it lasts a good maybe three hours. Well, that is my look at the Juva Lips product and oh my land, I am so happy. I'm in a hurry, I'm on my way to work, but let's do a little thought for the day. We'll see what God and the universe has in store for us. Maybe it'll be something to do with lips, who knows? Okay, God, bring it on. Okay, here we go. Okay, this is a good one. Trusting in life. Trusting in life. Today I will trust that the events occurring in my life are not random. My experiences aren't mistakes. And the universe, my higher power, and life are not picking on me. I'm going through exactly what I need to go through to learn something valuable. Something that will prepare me for the joy and love I'm seeking. Oh ladies, what a great card. Let's just go with the flow today and accept life and trust that life has everything wonderful in store for us. Sometimes I think that's half the battle in life is to turn off that negativity and just expect good things. Because when we expect that God and the universe are on our side, we can relax, go with the flow, and have a fabulous second half. Take care, see you next time.